Welcome, David. Hi. Hello, Chef. I'm, gonna, I'm very good, thank you. I'm going to give you a microphone. Thank welcome, you. welcome. Thank, thank you, thank you. Okay, Chef. Hello. So, David, you run a two-star restaurant in California. Yes, two stars for eight years. Yeah, that's fantastic. Manresa. Correct. Tell us about it. Uh, Manresa is a restaurant that is about one hour south of San Francisco. It's in the foothills of the Santa Cruz Mountains, yeah. uh, where the mountains meet the Pacific Ocean. Uh, I'm about five minutes away from Silicon Valley, which is uh, the, my, my customer base. Uh, we've been open for about 12 years. About seven years ago, we formed an exclusive relationship with a farm that has about 200, 250 different cultivars, fruits, vegetables, herbs exclusively for the Organic. restaurants. Yeah. Uh, biodynamic, yeah. everything biodynamic. Um, all the eggs are supplied for the restaurants. Uh, goat milk, where we make our own cheese for the restaurant, also. Fantastic. So, uh, do you, do you have a, a lot of access to good produce like uh, the meats and fish and so on as well? Very much so. We spend a lot of our time sourcing. We we're firm believers that uh, it is the fundamental tenet of our cuisine is yeah. getting the best possible product we can. Yeah. Is there any way you can just tell us a little, little bit about your uh, cuisine? How, how you, what, what's your philosophy, basically? Well, the most important thing we try to do is our, we want our food to be not only representative of who we are, but where we are also. Uh, the connection with the farm is a big part of that. In general, our food tends to be very vegetable-centric, with a lot of fish and shellfish and just a little bit of meat. Yeah, but just a little bit of you. Yes, sir. <laughs> yeah, when I'm not in Sweden. <laughs> so, you've been here a couple of days, and I heard you went to uh, Magnus Nilsson at Fäveken in Aura. Yes. In yes. Uh, well, how was that? It was fantastic. I've had a great time since I've been here. Everybody's been really nice. I've been to, every restaurant I've been to has been excellent, and I've been very well treated. I can't wait to come back. I think you will be back next year. That would be fantastic. <laughs> I accept. <laughs> So, uh, Andos, do you have any specific questions? No, I for? think you asked a lot of good questions and you asked them is there perfectly, so we know. No? Is there any special thing that, that you would like to uh, tell the Swedish uh, restaurant and hotel industry when you have the possibility? Mm. What should we do to make a success like you? Well, I think uh, the single most important thing, of course, is, is to take care of the customer. Uh, you take care of the customer, do the best you can to ensure the customer's happiness and to raise awareness about the quality ingredients and the importance of products, it's a win-win situation for everyone. The restaurant wins, the industry wins, and of course the customer benefits from it also. Thank you very much, David. My pleasure. Thanks for having me. And uh, now you have to go back to the jury, the judgment team, yes. and uh, we look forward to the, to the results that's going to come in a few, in a one, in actually in one hour. Thanks again. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, David. A applause yes. for David Kinch. Och eh, vi är alltså tillbaks. 15 och 15, då är det dags för prisutdelningen. Vi tar en liten kort paus. Ja, vad är det? Ja.